Hey, what's up everybody? I hope you all are having a great day and a great start to week. So today I want to talk about a topic that I think a lot of people don't want to talk about and don't want to hear. But at the same time, I think it's a great topic to talk about and a great topic to discuss and reflect upon because it really holds a lot of power. And that is taking responsibility. You see a lot of people, and this isn't just like now. It's not a new thing. It's been an ongoing thing for probably forever. <laughs> Where people are blaming other people for the current situation that they're in. People are blaming the government. People are blaming the president. People are blaming the par their parents. People are blaming the people who, who are in their lives for their current situation that they're stuck in. When in reality, it's really themselves. They are the ones to blame. And don't get me wrong. I do this too sometimes. And then I wake up and realize, oh, it's me, right? <laughs> It's me. I'm the one who should be taking responsibility for my action. I'm, I'm the one who should be taking responsibility for the current situation that I'm in. And if I don't like a certain situation that I'm in, guess who has the power to change it? Me. You. We all have the power to change it. And the cool thing is once you take responsibility, once you realize, once you swallow the hard truth that it is your fault why you are in this current, responsibility, current situation, that now we have the power. That gives us the power to be able to change it. That gives us the power to realize that since we got ourselves into this situation, we have the power to get ourselves out of this situation. And once you realize that, then you can start making an action plan. You can start really um, figuring out, okay, how can I get myself in this situation? And this isn't, this could be just anything from like finances. It could be um, relationship problems. It could be, uh, you know, current, uh, your, your, the surroundings that you're currently a part of. It could be uh, health issues, whatever it happens to be for you. Take responsibility for it. And then you could start making, start making action plans. Do research it. You could find, so like if, if you feel like um, you don't like the financial situation that you're in, or if you feel like that you don't like your job or whatever it happens to be, you can start finding people in a field that you want to get in into, whether it's on the internet. Cool thing we have the internet, so we don't have to physically search these people, search, search new friends, and search um, a new center of influence out. So um, if it's like um, if you want to like lose weight or get fit, or you want to look like a have the body of a certain celebrity, I'm sure there is um, information online about what you can do to get that kind of body and get that kind of um, that health result that you want. There's so many things that we could do. See, once you, you take responsibility, and once you realize that we got ourselves in this situation, then you can take, have the power to take it back. Then you have the power to change it for yourself. So, main message in this video, take responsibility. Realize that it's all our fault. It's tough, it may be tough to go to small, but it's okay. Because once you are able to, to swallow that, once you are able to realize that, you could you could find, start to take action. You're in control. You're 100% in control with your life. You're 100% in control of the outcome of your life from here on out. And then, once you take action, once you take that courage, once you take that leap, because sometimes it can be a little scary. Then, then you that's how you start beginning to really change your life. And who knows what could happen. So yeah, I hope you, someone got something out of this video and I hope you have a great rest of your day and a great rest of your week and I'll talk to you next time. Bye everybody.